How's it going, bros? My name is PewDiePie. And today it's Saturdays with PewDiePie. No, it's not gonna happen. But anyways, what's up, guys? It's Dark Matter Gaming here, and today I'm making a vlog before I play video games. So this vlog is mainly uh, just another update about what I'm thinking about doing. Uh, mm. So, on Monday, I'll be making a Black Ops 3 video. I think I've mentioned that a million times in my last video. Oh, but today, before this video starts, because this video is actually story time. So, I wanted to tell you guys uh, that the Fallout series will be continuing once I get everything set up. Because recording Fallout does take up a lot of space on my phone. And I'm going to find out a way to try to get... I'm going to record Fallout on my Xbox, transfer it to OneDrive, get it on a USB, get it to my mom's computer, get it to her computer, then get it to my phone. Then I'll have a nice Fallout video with no audio. I'll probably put... No, I can't even put audio behind it. I'll probably just not... But I don't know. It's whatever, but it will be continuing. I'll find a way to do it, because, you know, I'm creative like that, I guess. I, you could say I'm creatively depressed. But anyways, uh, also, uh, I have some new friends that I'm going to be doing some videos with. That's for the video on Monday. Um, they've been recently subscribing on my, I mean, commenting on my, uh, whatchamacallit, videos. So, uh, their gamer tags were actually left in a recent video. I forgot which one. But go check it out. Uh, there, if you want to find their gamer tag, you want to be featured in a video. Go ahead and you know find that if you even have an Xbox, because most of the people who watch my videos don't. But it's whatever. Um, so getting right into the video, story time. Um, hold up. Sorry about that. Um, anyways, back into the video. So story time. So today I'm going to be telling you guys a legendary story. Now this story contains of me. <laughs> um, this story is about uh, how I met two really good friends uh, last this recent school year. Um, so I already knew him in seventh grade. But Wolf Packs, Tony, uh, he's a really good friend. Uh, so today's his birthday. And so this video for story time is like a gift to him. So whatchamacallit, um, I was, after seventh grade, I, I didn't really get, keep in touch with a lot of people. I kept in touch with like three people. And like, that's it. And uh, I kept in touch with Random 2.0 Gaming. And we actually tried to make, what the heck was that? We actually tried to make a Nerf movie with uh, Nerf guns and stuff, but for my birthday. But it really didn't work out because you know we didn't have the the recording. I had a I had a camera and everything. Like we were actually gonna do it, but their camera only recorded certain you know times, and I couldn't get it over on a USB. And it, we just we just gave up kind of, and it, we kind of just had some fun with Nerf guns after that. But um, anyways. Uh, I ran, I, random 2.0 gaming, he's a good friend, but I lost contact with him, and then I recently just got back in contact with him when he commented under my video. And so, um, what I'm getting to is that, uh, Wolfpax and me, uh, it was in Miss Huff reading class, I believe, we started talking. He was like, what's up, Dom? And I'm like, hey. And I like... I was like, so what's going on? What's, what's been happening? Because I was like, I was like two weeks late. It's really nothing that serious. But they had already started reading a book, so I made friends with Tony. Uh, got his number and stuff, and you know it was really cool. You know we talked a little bit. Played. He was playing Black. He was playing Black Ops Three while I was playing uh, Black Ops Two. He had gotten the beta for Black Ops uh, Three, and so 
I think it was the beta. If it's not the beta, it was the full game. I, I can't remember. I just didn't have Black Ops 3 or an Xbox One at the time. So, um, I'm sitting there playing Black Ops 2 offline, XX Diamond Sword, uh, and I'm, like, playing zombies and stuff on transit or farm. And, you know, we talk on the phone. We become really good friends. And so there's this time at the lunch table where we're sitting down and we're randomly talking, like, with a group of friends that we have and, like, you know, someone said, I think it was my friend Lavosky said, we get along like the Beatles. And I was like, well, we're black, so we got to come up with something better than that. And they were like, yo, we Beatles squad. And I was like, squad, squad, squad. And everybody started acting like Chief Keef. It was really stupid. But, um, and then I was like, that's actually really good. And I wanted to talk to Tony about it. So I called him and I was like, dude, we should make this thing called Beatles squad. And he was like, what's Beatles squad? And he's like, well, it's our group of friends and, you know, we're just weird and, do stuff together and he's like okay let's do it bro and i was like but tony came tony's the guy who came up with it he was the he's the founder of beetle squad because he's the person that mentioned it first he was like he was like we should be beetle squad and i was like yeah we should be beetle squad and i was but i i've had forgotten about it already and when i got back out when i got back home and i was like oh okay well let's do this let's just be a group of friends let's be like team 10 except that we're not gay i hate you jake paul but anyways, um, we, uh, we made, he made Beatles Squad and he made me leader. Now, the reason he made me leader is because that, I mean, I guess he just didn't want to be leader. I'm not good at leading, but this experience gave me, like, the base to leading. Like, and I always wanted to lead my own, like, clan or something, like, FaZe or something, like, on Xbox Live or something. Like, the Vanoss Gaming or something like that. I always wanted to be a leader. But, I mean, I never really got that chance because I really didn't have a lot of friends back, you know, in elementary school. Did I say elementary school when I was talking before? Seventh grade doesn't count as elementary school. It's middle school. That's what I meant to say because I'm not, I'm not, like, seven. But, um, yeah, uh... So, I, uh, I made friends with Tony, we, you know, had this great big group of friends called Beatles Squad, we had 108 members <laughs> from different school, from like elementary school and middle school, and like we found random people to join, and it was cool, but the only thing, me and Tony really couldn't hold Beatles Squad on our shoulders, we couldn't do it all the time, it was me and Tony, we were always the leaders of Beatles Squad. But soon to be came a girl in our group and her name's Alexis. And we were like, we, we needed a girl in our group because we didn't have a girl in our group. It was all boys and it was weird because we all just talked about girls and it was stupid. And we were like, hey man, she's hot, man. <laughs> but um, Alexis, she was walking in the hall one time and I was like walking too. And I was like, it's a girl new my class it's cool it's whatever and so i just started I, I i was like keep my eye on her i'm just like okay well i don't know what she's like maybe she's like super annoying and obnoxious and super popular type girl Ugh, don't want to deal with that but then my my enemy my mortal enemy but used to be friend kylie wrote a song for her <laughs> Two socks <laughs> and drew pictures for her and stuff. So we were at the lunch table. This is when we were friends. Uh, he was sitting at the table writing a song, and I was like, "Who's that for?" Because there was a giant heart on it, and like he like covered the paper at the lunch. Table. What you talking about, bro? <laughs> but um, I was like, "Is that for the new girl?" He was like, "No." Anyways, your name's Alexis, man. Get it right. Yeah, it's for the new girl. And I was like, Tony, you see this crap? He was like, whatever, man. It's stupid. And so, um, I, at the time, I was planning on taking Beetle Squad to the Woods of Terror in North Carolina. It's this thing where it's like all the horror movies built into one big forest. And oh god, it's the most terrifying place on the planet besides Disney World. So, um... <laughs> The Woods of Terror is like Freddy Krueger has real claws and he'll like scrape the metal wall. Michael Myers has a freaking knife that he sticks into a tree and chases and walks around with you. 
uh, Jason has a real machete. Jeepers Creepers flies out of a bus. And then they have their own attractions that will, if you scream, they will trap you in a corner because that's what happened to me. I was literally just randomly looking at a snake that this guy had and the snake got closer to my face. I was like, ah! and then I got back into the corner. Then some guy with knives started flipping knives around and chopping. Like, you know how, like, if you hit metal together, fire, like, sparks come out? I was like, no, no, no. And then a lady with a freaking samurai sword came over, and it was weird, and she started eating the samurai sword. It was really weird, okay? I may be over-exaggerating, but it was that weird. They actually cornered me. My mom had to come save me. Really embarrassing. But, um, besides that, so it was art class. She was in my art class, too, so she uh, had walked past me. And I was like, that's a new girl that Kylie likes. And he invited her to the Woods of Terror with us. And she wasn't even in Beatle Squad yet. So I was like, hey, yo, you, hey, you're, you're new girl, right? And she, and I was like, oh, well, my friend invited you to the Woods of Terror with us. And, uh, you know, I was just wanting to see you making sure that, you know, I don't know, you can go. And she, you're, she was just like, and I was like, cool. It was really weird because I did it in front of a Because we were like lining up right outside of the art class door. And so um, our real first conversation was like me and Quan, my friend Quan. Me and my Quan. Me and Bola. I can't speak Spanish. I'm sorry for everybody that I just offended. Don't kill me. But um, Quan, he was like... Uh, Hey man, you see white girl right there? And I was like, uh, yeah, new girl, yeah, yeah. He was like, yo man, she fine, man. I was like, yeah, Quan. Quan's Kwan. really weird. Quan was my dad, so uh, don't take that the wrong way. <laughs> but um, he was like, yo. So then she came over and he he was already he already made friends with her and stuff. And I was like, dude, I'm just tripping some serious balls. I like sniffed so many co so much cocaine last night because I was really tired, but I acted like I was sniffing cocaine. And so she was like, man, you, and you didn't share, and that's how we became friends. <laughs> and so then I tricked Kylie into giving me her number. We talked and became really good friends in one night. And uh, yeah, Kylie got really mad at me because he thought I was trying to steal her, which was my original plan. But anyway, she became second in command in Beatles Squad, became really good friends. We don't really talk that much that like as much as we used to, but I mean, it's we're 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 cool. It's 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 really nothing, but you know, it's just an argument. It's just an argument. But um yeah. So uh that's uh story time for you guys. Uh, I'm gonna be make I'm gonna be playing Xbox with my friends. So like, comment, subscribe, and, uh, I'm trying to do an outro, because this is my, isn't this my outro? Or is it, no, that's, that's the brofist. Uh, I don't know my outro. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching the video. Why did I look that way? I saw myself look that way in the camera. That's weird. The camera's slow. But anyways. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Uh, like, hit that dislike button. Don't forget to hit the dislike button. Always good. Uh, turn off notifications so I don't annoy you. Uh, and make sure to uh, leave an offensive comment about my crippling depression in the description. Wait, not the description. The comment section. And uh, the description is probably going to be in German because that's what I always do. I put it in a foreign language so someone can figure out a puzzle. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching the video. And I'll see you in the darkness. Oh, that was cringy. I'm gonna get so much crap for it. I don't care. This video is gonna take forever to upload anyways.